evening, uh, members of the diplomatic corps, dear friends, and especially partners from uh, Philbiz News. I actually prepared some speech, but I just learned that we have lots of ambassadors here, and if, uh, if each one of us will spend a few minutes, uh, we will be uh, standing too long. So let me just tell you very briefly that uh, what I would like to uh, say is to express my special thanks to my dear friend Monsi Serrano, and all his colleagues from Philbiz News, because what they do for this country and also for us, for diplomatic community, is, is uh, super important. Uh, I could speak about the trade, uh, and as we had our prime minister here last uh, week, we, of course, uh, talk about the trade, but we also talked about, as Laura said, media freedom, which is super important and you can rely on not only Czech Republic or United Kingdom, I can say that you can rely on all embassies from European Union, that we will definitely do everything to support uh, media, freedom of media in this country. Uh, let me say maybe one last thing. Uh, last, uh, last Monday, during our prime minister visit and his bilateral meeting with President Marcos, we launched a book which is called Kai Bigan, Friends in Czech Přátelé, and it covers the history between Czech and Filipino, not only diplomatic relations, and uh, maybe I would not limit myself on the Czech Republic, but on the whole European Union and, and Europe in general, because I uh, believe much more in, in regions than in like national states and countries. So. Uh, let me give floor to other friends. Let me congratulate again to Monsi. He is really special to me, and I will be leaving uh, very soon. So I would like to express my my thanks to him and commitment of the Czech Embassy to be on his side always. So thank you so much, Maraming Salamat, and enjoy the evening. <laughs>